Hi, uh, this is Jacob, uh, and I wanted to talk to you today a little bit about paper and keeping it where it's supposed to be. Uh, so first step is to get a little bit of paper. Oh, oh my god. More than a little bit of paper, a lot of paper. Get all your important papers and put them, we want to make them stable, which is difficult uh, in here, but we're going to fix that problem today. So get your important papers. I have a bunch from when I was 18. And uh, pick out one that you think is going to be best and get it started. So you're probably wondering, this. I mean, I got this B, but this was a really hard class, actually. Uh, and I was taking a lot of really hard classes, so like, as a piece of paper, it actually, I think it's a record of something good I did. And oh, my handwriting was outrageous. Look at this, what happened to me? You'd think it would go the other direction whenever you're growing up, that you would like, take your handwriting more seriously, you know? I would think. But I guess that's not how it works, I don't know. God, sometimes I wonder if somebody else is doing this writing. Who is this? doesn't feel like, you know, sometimes you don't feel like yourself, I guess, especially when you look back on it. But it was you. I don't know, man. College was like another time. Maybe it wasn't. You go through a lot of phases, right? God, once the memories flow, they like don't really stop flowing. D's or something. That was brutal, man. Whatever, medieval Spanish literature. How was I supposed to do that while I was taking an architecture studio? And that's our paperweight.